I think I started something. I got what I wanted. Bit did not can't feel nothing. Superhuman, even when I'm for Agra, popping every single record. Auto tune in, zero emotion, muted emotion, pitch corrected, computed emotion. Uh-huh. I blame it on a model bra with a Hollywood smile. Hey guys, what's up, what it do? Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. I'm Pacey, and if you are new, take a second, go down below, hit that subscribe button, and put that little bell button so you don't miss when I post a new video. Sorry if you guys can hear my dogs in the background, they're kind of fussy right now. But as you guys can see by the title, today we are going to be talking a little bit about updates to the kitchen. I ended up buying a bunch of, like, <laughs> I mentioned in my last update video that I have purchased a bunch of cute cooking things on Amazon, so I'm going to be sharing those today. I also just got... my cooking set in the mail, um, a bunch of other things in the mail for the kitchen. So yeah, we're gonna be unboxing and talking about all the things that I got. All right, so these two boxes over here are actually for the bedroom. So these are, as you can see, they're actually floating nightstands. So they're going to be mounted to the wall once we have the bed and everything already set up. So we're not really gonna be getting into these today. But over here I have a bunch of new stuff for the kitchen. We're going to unbox everything and I actually wanted to do like an Instagram real unboxing of this cooking set. I don't know if you guys have heard of Caraway, but it's kind of pricey, not gonna lie. But it's a very, very popular like kitchenware set. So I'm excited to open it and see how it is. This is a box from Amazon, my knife set. And then this is also a box from Amazon. I don't even know what this is to be honest with you so let's get into it let's unbox them all right so the first thing that i'm going to unbox is the package from caraway as you can see i have my other camera right here so that way i can film an instagram reel opening it let's go ahead and open her All right, so I just finished unboxing everything and I'm about to set up the little um, cabinet compartment thing. Also going to be recording this for the reel, so that's why I have my other camera right here. You gotta get the right angle at all costs. I gotta see if I want it on this side or this side. I also need to clear this out because I have old pants and pots in here. All right, I'm just moving this stuff. I'm probably gonna end up getting rid of these. I've had these same like pots and pans for a minute now. All right, so it came with these hooks that I had to place on here. I gotta make sure that I do it wide enough. Probably should have measured it first, but. All right, so. Oh shoot, this one has to go here. You can hook it. Let's see. Hello? Hello? I'll meet you at the elevator. Huh? I'll meet you at the elevator. Alright. I'll meet you at the elevator to make it easier for you. All right, I'm coming. Yeah, I'll be at the, what you call it? I'll be at the, All right. I forgot to show these in the unboxing, but they also came with these little dividers to put in the cabinet so it stays organized, which I love. Okay, so I just finished organizing the cookware. I love it. I still gotta organize the top shelf, but yeah, it looks so good. It's like, 
I love an organized kitchen cabinet. Like I hate when my kitchen cabinets are not organized like this one. I'll be feeling like I can't find anything so I don't even wanna cook. But this is motivating. Gotta get rid of all these boxes. And some of the stuff I am gonna keep but some of it I'm probably going to either give away or throw away. Some of it is damaged. And I also successfully did my reel so hopefully it came out good and I can post it. Frenchie over here upset because he wants to come out. But I can't have them out while I'm doing stuff like this because they're both bad. <laughs> and they will try to chew up everything over here and I don't have time. And they also love to play together and <laughs> they be attacking each other. And I have to make sure that I'm watching them when they're out together. So we're going to probably go to the dog park later. He's mad now though. <laughs> so this next box that's from Amazon, we're going to open up. I think this is the glass bowls. I love them. I'm gonna wash them. And I'm gonna wash the cookware too. I just kind of wanted to place it under there so I could see how it would look, but I'm gonna wash it, don't worry. Last thing is this knife set. Whoa. <laughs> and I like it also because it comes with the compartments. I think it just helps to look more sleek. No. This is bomb. <laughs> this is gonna look so good. And it has the black finish. Knives are in here. <laughs> it comes with a knife sharpener, which I think is pretty cool. I don't think I've ever gotten a knife set that comes with a knife sharpener. So I never sharpen them. <laughs> Cause where do you buy a knife sharpener? Where the hell do you buy a knife sharpener? I mean, I'm sure you could buy them, but like, who thinks to buy a knife sharpener? The set should come with it. Anyway, here are the knives. I really just wanted to see how this. What the heck is this? This is how you know I don't cook. <laughs> what do you use this for? All right. I'm gonna put. Let me not make a mess. Y'all, I have a phone charger in every room, literally. All right. This is so dope. How much was this? I gotta look and see how much this was. I think it was like 50 something, but I still think that's good for good knives. I do not be looking at prices. That is like the worst advice I could ever give, but it's true. Oh my God. You guys, the knife, it's a pizza knife. You see it right here? It says pizza on there. Why doesn't mine say pizza? Does mine say pizza? Mine does not say pizza, unless this isn't the right one. Oh, this isn't the right one. Okay, so there's another one in there that looks like this, that's for pizza. That's so cute. Not that I ever cut my pizza, cause it's usually already cut, but it's 54 bucks. I don't think that's bad for like a really nice knife set. I'm gonna put this down below. And remember, the sharpener, the sharpener. You cannot go wrong with this. Like you really can't. I'm gonna put it right next to it so I remember to sharpen my knives. Cause who thinks to do that? Not me. Oh, I think it's backwards. Yeah, right here. This is gonna look bomb as hell. You guys can see. This is super close to the outlet. So what I might have to do is move the sharpener to this side. Maybe it'll make some space. Perfect. I don't think there's anything that sticks out of this corner, so that should be good. And I'll just put this here. Perfect. All right, I'm about to wash the knives and then and put them in so we can see what it looks like. Okay, this is cute. I'm gonna put the scissors in the drawer. Um, oh, that's on the bedroom. 
Oh wait, the scissors might fit because it was backwards. But this will not fit because of the switch. What light does this turn on? <laughs> That's the garbage disposal. And y'all, there's nothing in my garbage disposal, but for some reason it sounds like there's something in there. Like I think one of the pieces are lifted or something, but there's not there's no silverware or anything in the garbage disposal but it sounds like it for some reason i, I checked like so many times so, so it's in line with the stove well that's gonna remind me that this is the garbage disposal so that's everything that i got today but i still want to show you guys some things that i had got previously but i got this on amazon i literally got so much kitchen stuff on amazon y'all i got this on amazon which is um it's an electric kettle and it's really cool because you can connect it to your phone and like set it to start boiling the water when you're not even, you know, next to it. So this drawer is not organized yet, so don't judge me. But I wanted to show you guys the silverware. So I got this um, drawer, what do you call it? <laughs> drawer organizer thing. <laughs> silverware organizer. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The little thing that divides the silverware. I got this on Amazon and I picked it because I wasn't sure if this was like big enough for the larger sized ones but i knew it would fit this size and this one actually extends so if this was a little bit wider than i thought i could have extended this out and it would have had more space which is kind of cool but if it's perfectly in here like this but it gets bigger too which i really like the only thing is that there's only three dividers so right now we kind of have silverware just like in the same section and then some other things back here but yeah i got this off amazon and i also got the silverware off amazon i love the design of these they're like shaped a little bit different i don't even know how to describe it but i feel like they just have like a modern feel to them so i really like a shape i really like the shape of these i was gonna get the matte black ones at first but because i was getting a matte black tray i was like it would look weird to have black silverware on top of the black tray that's why i didn't get it oh it also came with knives i'll put the set down below and then all oh, down here is some more stuff i got off amazon so yeah this drawer is a mess still i haven't gotten a chance to organize it yet but i really like this can opener i actually had got one of these from my mom it's gonna focus there we go i got one of these for, for my mom for christmas because my mom likes practical gifts <laughs> And it's nice because it's like a one touch thing. So you just grip it onto the can opener, press this, and then it like literally goes around in a circle on its own. You just have to stop it when it's finished. So I use this for the dog's dog food cans. Then I also really like these measuring cups, like the stainless steel ones. I think that they're really sturdy. They should last a lot longer. Every time I get measuring cups, the freaking, um, numbers always fade so i figured the stainless steel would be sturdy and good quality so a few of my home purchases were actually inspired by Aaliyah's face she posted this on instagram which i haven't even gotten a chance to try yet but it's like a spout that you put on your wine bottle and then you can just press the button at the top and it'll automatically like take the wine out for you it's like a wine straw that's what i like to call it because it comes with this thing as well so when you press the button the wine will go up the string and into your bottle so you don't have to pour it I can't wait to try it. I'm gonna probably try it on camera. I actually bought that before we moved, but just haven't gotten a chance to try it. Oh, something else that's kind of cool is this. This is a pancake spatula. Like, a pancake spatula. It works so perfectly. You suck at flipping pancakes, you need that. I also um, purchased some ice cube trays with like different shapes, just in case I wanted to be fancy. I bought a bunch of different ones even got squares too just so i could like have some fun and make some cute drinks and stuff super cheap on amazon this is also something that i really like that i got from amazon it's um a loose tea infuser so you literally just put the loose tea inside of here and then close it up and then you can drop it in your tea thing and it actually has my wow my hands are ashy that's embarrassing but it just it just hooks onto the side so it doesn't fall into the tea which i like that came in a set i think as well with a couple different ones i don't think anything else in here i got from amazon oh i'm lying i also got this ice cream scooper on amazon <laughs> and it's weird like i've never seen an ice cream scooper this sturdy before and i really like it also 
I wanted to focus so y'all can see the shape. I really like the shape of it. I feel like it really does like scoop the ice cream out really well. So yeah, and it's cute, it's pink. I also want to show you guys my wine glasses. Ooh. <laughs> so you guys already know how excited I was about this wine cooler in our unfurnished apartment tour. But oh my God, I'm even more excited now because I actually have wine glasses. So I have a bunch of different ones. I actually went above and beyond and I got these little um, mini cocktail cups. These are so cute. I love the shape of these. I think I also found these on um, Aaliyah's face. These I got from CB2. They kind of have a matte, like a frosted bottom. These I like solely because they're plastic. So I don't have to worry about these breaking. For some reason I'm like the queen of breaking wine glasses. So I know I need to have some plastic ones just in case that does happen with the glass ones. <laughs> Definitely pays to know yourself. Um, I think the last thing is going to be actually right over here above the cabinet with the new cookware in it. I just organized our dishware. Kind of sort of, it's kind of sort of organized. I got these dish racks also from Amazon and these gorgeous flat plates. Like, I think these are so nice. The only bad thing about this material is that it feels super hot when you take it out the microwave but they're microwavable they're dishwasher safe like and they're so nice i think they just look so minimalist and sleek and they match the kitchen so well i also got these um what are these called <laughs> cutting boards dre really likes taco tuesdays and so i'm excited to use this cutting board for when i have to cut up the lettuce the tomato and all that stuff has like different compartments for it i also like having different sized ones just in case you know cutting up different things this is the silverware that we were using before i got the silverware that we have now even though it's not silverware it's plasticware but i was pretending like it was silverware for two months and then i also got these also from Aaliyah's face amazon or probably not her amazon but i think she posted them on instagram these cute little dipping cups like when you need a side of ketchup or like a side of barbecue sauce you can just pour it in here there you go i think they're so cute i usually just like squirt it on a plate I'll put it in like a plastic bowl, but these are so adorable. And then this is what I just showed you guys with the new cookware under here. That's all that's there. I think that might be everything for the kitchen stuff. Oh, I lied. <laughs> I also got just like regular glasses for everyday drinks. So I got two sizes. I forget how many fluid ounces the big ones are, but I got bigger size cups. I wanna say it's 16 fluid ounces, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm gonna put them down below. Um, and then I also got the smaller ones. I think these are eight ounces. We actually have a lot, we have a lot more of them, but we've been drinking out of them, so they're in the dishwasher currently. A lot of you guys also wanted to know about this cup that I actually used in the beginning of my video that I posted last time, the last apartment update. This is also inspired by Elias Face. Amazon and I'm gonna put the link to these down below. I think they're so cute. The only issue that I had is after I washed it I feel like the color kind of faded a little bit It's kind of annoying because it looked when I first got it. It looked so nice and sleek. So I don't really like this plastic that much, but Yeah, you can see the marks on it already and that's just from washing it. So yeah, they're cute, but Not the best quality and then down here is just still junky. I haven't even gotten to this yet, but yeah, I think it's coming along. So yeah, that is everything that I have for the kitchen so far. But I do want to show you guys the dining set that I'm looking at getting. It is on CB2 and it is gorgeous. It's kind of like modern, but modern comfy. I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all. <laughs> I've been getting so excited. This this must be what adults feels like. Getting excited over furniture. So this is the chair. You probably like that for a kitchen chair, but... Hear me out, hear me out, okay? Look, it's so nice. Let me show you guys some other angles of it. That's on a load. I think it's so nice, and I love the black benches. I think it's gonna look so good in the kitchen. This is actually the picture that I was kind of inspired by. Cause this is the table that I wanna get. I'm gonna show you guys, but I want it in black. But you can see the chairs with this table. I think it looks so nice. I don't know if I'm gonna put a rug like that picture has in the kitchen. Wow, <laughs> here we go. I'm not probably gonna put a rug. I'm not sure yet, but. And then let me go back so I can show you the table in black. I just love it so much. 
And it's only two of us, so we really don't need like a full dining table, you know what I mean? When we have guests, we'll probably not even eat in here to be honest. Like we may eat in the living room, which we have chair space. Um, we might even take them like upstairs. I don't know, we probably won't eat in here. So this is perfect for just the two of us. And I think with the space, cause this is like the whole kitchen right here. Right over there would start um, the living room, but this space here is the kitchen. So I would want the kitchen table to kind of be in the center with the two chairs, one on that side and then one on this side. But that's not a priority. Like I'm probably not gonna get that until early next year. It's on back order anyway. I've been looking at other things and I can't find anything that I like more than this. So I'll just wait for that. But I feel like we had all of our basics. Like I mentioned, the bed and the dresser are about to be here soon in the beginning of November. My office is pretty much finished. Like I wanna decorate it more, but obviously decorations can wait. I even have the laundry room pretty much set up how I want it. The dog stuff is set up perfectly. So I feel like we have enough to be able to function and function pretty well. The decorations and all the extra stuff can wait. Same thing with the patio, like that's probably gonna be your early next year project, but I'm happy with where we are right now. Like, get situated, get all the things that I need, and then, you know, gradually get the extra things. I also wanna buy plants. Like I have so much I wanna buy, but I gotta slow down. <laughs> so, yeah, that is the end of this video. But yeah, I guess this just ended up being a kitchen update which is fine, I'm cool with that. So I wanna say that the next update is going to be the master bedroom update, but I'm not 100% sure. We're just gonna kinda go with the flow with these vlogs. So I'll see you guys whenever I have an update to give. Bye.